Hello and welcome to HelpYourMath.com. In this video, we're going to talk about biconditional statements and their truth values. So first, let's review what a biconditional statement is. A biconditional statement is a statement of the form if and only if, so P, if and only if Q, we can simplify it down to IFF, that's totally allowed, and the notation is an arrow facing either way, so we would say P, if and only if Q. A biconditional, it's called a biconditional because it's a conjunction of two conditional statements. So it's the conjunction of if P then Q and if Q then P. So it's the conjunction of those two statements. That's what that biconditional means. Okay, so let's talk about the truth value of a biconditional statement. So again, if uh, P if and only if Q means P then Q and Q then P. So let's consider when a biconditional statement is true. So we're going to fill in our truth table. And remember here what we're looking for is if P then Q and if Q then P. Okay, so if P then Q, remember this is going to be true when P is false or Q is true. So if true then true, that's a true statement. If true then false, that's no good, that's a false statement. If false, when the hypothesis is true, the conditional is true, and that's going to also work here. So that'll be true, false, true, true for if P then Q. What about for if Q then P? So here we have if true then true, good. If false, that's good, that's going to be a true conditional. If true then false, that's no good. Mm -mm. If false, that's good to go, we're true. And now we're looking for the conjunction of this and this. So we have true and true is true. False and true is false, right? Because a conjunction, you need everything to be true. True and false is false. And true and true is true. So when is a biconditional statement true? Going back to the original two statements, it's true when they're both false or when they're both true. So they have to have the same truth value. P and Q have to have the same truth value in order for the biconditional statement to be true. And that's really important to know. You might want to write that down. So the biconditional is true when P and Q have the same truth value. So they're either both true or they're both false. If one's one and one's the other, that doesn't work. The biconditional is true when P and Q have the same truth value. Let's look at some examples. So pause the video, decide whether each of these biconditional statements are true or false. Starting with seven is greater than seven, that is a false statement. And five plus two equals 25 is a false statement. So we have false if and only a false. The biconditional is True, this one is true, right? They have the same truth values. So the biconditional is true. How about this one? We have four is less than or equal to four. That's true. Three is less than negative nine. That is false. So true if and only a false. Nope, they don't have the same truth value. This one is false. And our last example, there are eight planets if and only if Pluto is not a planet. Poor Pluto. Um, there are eight planets currently in 2020, that is true. Pluto is currently not a planet, it's a dwarf planet, that is true. So the biconditional is true. This has been a video on biconditional statements. Thank you for